Hi guys, this is uh, Pipun Joshi from CricketMerchant.com and I'm here today to review SS Big Ton 47. This is the big brother, the little brother is the Ton 47. Again, you know, this is Big Ton 47 Grade 1 English Willow Cricket Bat. An awesome willow, does have um, redwood on this side, roughly about 4 grains. And you can see the other grains uh, pretty clean and neat. Let's count how many of those we have. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So we're looking at a 12 straight looking grains on a Big Ton 47 um, SS Cricket Bag. Again, these are available on cricketmerchant.com for you to purchase. Uh, Big Ten 47, excellent willow, does not have a toe guard and if you wish to have a toe guard on your cricket bat you can always purchase uh, the SS bat repair kit that comes with a toe guard, does have a toe guard glue, does also have edge tape, the face tape as well and an oil which is a smaller version of this 100 ml uh, linseed raw natural oil. This is also something you could purchase. Uh, oiling is always recommended on a cricket bat to increase the longevity uh, life of the bat basically and helps retain the moisture within the bat which indicates that uh, there would be um, partially some less chances of breaking a bat if the moisture level within the bat remains at a certain uh, level. Uh, I do not know precisely how much of moisture does the bat require but it is always recommended uh, by professionals as well uh, that you know you need to have at least uh, two coat of oil on a cricket bat uh, which is dry in nature uh, and if you're planning to use it for the first time in the season and every year you can kind of add one quart of oil on every uh, at every place you see an exposed wood so even if you have a face plate on top you can still apply oil everywhere you can see exposed wood it will penetrate in and will make sure it retains the moisture within the bat increasing the life and performance of the bat again you're looking at a big 1047 cricket bat does have a huge profile so let's check on that uh, 1.5 I believe yes as mentioned before as well they maintain this uh, thickness on the bats this one particular way is 212 does not feel 212 at all so let me uh, make that clear again this one does weigh 212 um, you know they have started uh, weighing the bats before sending to us uh, so <clears throat> again this one does not feel 212 uh, it's a huge profile equally balanced uh, profile uh, cricket bat again this is a grade one below uh, feels really good um. <clears throat> nice okay I guess I'm rusty on my skills at this point but you know <clears throat> uh, let's check something on this this is a grade 1 willow so I expect this to be a awesome wow look at that Some serious pain. Oh my god. Whoa. This one does have some serious pain. Again, this is a semi new, about 20 overs old ball um, that I'm looking at. So it's not something that, you know, you're looking at a paint which is from a new ball. So even with a soft 20 over old or 35 over old, I'm, I'm, I'm not even sure. I believe this is 25 over old ball you're looking the ping at. Awesome willow, Big Ten 47. You can purchase yours uh, from cricketmerchant.com. Again, you know, uh, you can find a better bat than this uh, in other brands. Uh, there might be, but in SS specifically, these are some serious stock A grade or grade 1 willow cricket bats. Big Ten 47, go and get yours from cricketmerchant.com. Choice. I let you push me past the break
breaking point. 